Tonight, there is a new vice mayor in the largest city in Hampton Roads. Jim Wood resigned after taking a job with an international corporation. And today, Virginia Beach City Council appointed longtime councilwoman Rosemary Wilson to fill that seat. Angelique Arentalk spoke to her, but Angelique, you learned at least one other council member caused this a missed opportunity for diversity. Yeah, council member Aaron Rouse expressed to me that he's disappointed with the result today, not for himself, but for the city. Council member Wooten received one vote, council member Rouse three, council member Wilson six. A member of council for 21 years, Rosemary Wilson received the votes needed to become the next vice mayor. I bring a lot of experience and his you know, historic knowledge. Also a former teacher, she describes it an honor to continue her work in public service. It's been more than 30 years since a woman served as vice mayor in the city. To, to work with your colleagues and also to be a conduit to help with the staff. But Councilman Aaron Rouse also wanted to be vice mayor. He told us he believes he was best qualified. This was a great opportunity to say we are moving forward. Virginia Beach is the place um, of diversity and, and inclusion. Rouse's bid to be vice mayor captured support on Twitter from fellow Beach native, rapper, and music producer Pharrell Williams. Shows the world that everybody's paying attention to what's going on here. Rouse calls this appointment and the recent one of Rocky Holcomb to Jessica Abbott's old Kempsville seat as, quote, missed opportunities. It matters when you constantly have qualified minorities in a position to be appointed. They get overlooked. Wilson believes the council always wants to strive for inclusion and diversity. And I think we work very hard for that, but we, we do have two African Americans on the council, and he, he sitting right next to Councilman Ra uh, Rouse is the very first African American city manager that we've ever had. Despite the council's vote Tuesday, Rouse remains determined. There's still much more work to do, and I'm looking forward to doing that work with whom and with whoever. The way this appointment worked, Wilson will essentially fill out the rest of Jim Wood's, Jim Wood's term, excuse me, as vice mayor. That's until the end of next year.